Um, further measurements have shown that these areas are not useful. All other areas like uh, the relief here are, I mean, they are also con cave in here also and these are also no of no use so i think i'll start at the bottom there taking this straight down and then using at least these as references um, and then also taking this down And for the purpose of scraping and also measuring, we are down on the vise here. And this shows also the usefulness of such a big capacity vise. I can put it here and measure while this is not clamped down, of course, because you don't want to distort it. And then you can clamp it down and scrape it and also turn it and, uh, well, convenient. And then... Um, uh, I will take it gradual, step scrape it out to each end here on the underside and do the same on the top so that I sort of gradually uh, increases the flatness and then I will at one point start taking out the middle and relieve the middle area here. So um, I'll start here and then was the four area I'll turn around and take this and in here twice and then so three and then four I'll do the same here but um, somewhat more because he was six and then double what I take here I'll take here and then five here so that's my plan And since it's probably more interesting to see the power scraper in use, I'll use that. Okay. So now after one such cycle I've gotten down where it was five down to three six down to five or six no sorry eight down to five or six four here okay three and four here, also three. Meaning that I can at least take two more cycles, I guess. So, uh, after the second scraping session, what do I get here then? Uh, we have to compare against zero, of course. And, uh, oh, wow, we are, I call that zero, actually. Okay. Go like that. Deviating a little bit. So that's plus one, two, two. Here.
this is plus two, two, three. Keep in mind uh, if it is zero here still. Uh, it's sort of plus one here now. But anyway. And here is actually zero to minus one, so a bit low. Uh, so that means that we can scrape the relief at least, let's say two or three hundred slow. And then, but first I'll take this, say a couple of times, then these times, and zero times, and then also then zero time here. So here you see, and you do the same for the for the underside, not for the other side, the top. So one time more, and actually now they are a bit well, maybe even a bit low, uh, but they are within, uh, let's say plus minus one hundreds uh, with respect to the zero here. So now I'll try to. To relieve and then um, I blew up uh, the middle before I flip it and start on the other side. Yeah. Well, couldn't resist, just had to blow up. It wasn't so uh, shabby that, I think. Uh, actually, well, you can see for yourself. Um, so, Taking out the middle would mean, as I said, divided into three. So roughly here to here. And do away with that. And get up the points here. So here I am. Uh, Finishing the relief areas. Now I'll proceed to take out the blue here. So then we'll go and blow up this, this piece. So we see. No grit. Should be okay. Listen. And uh, hinge the part. Try at least. <coughs> and okay. 
think I'll take it there first, maybe a little bit here. At least distinct there. I can um, now also try to take out the blue and um, prepare a section here to see if this is really much higher. So I'll just do that first. And then uh, polish the piece on that part. I can see here, I guess you can too if you get the correct light, that we have a specific high area here, and also over here, so you can take them first on this one, before you do anything else. And uh, just having taken those, we can blow up again. Listen, doesn't appear to be any. It feels a bit better. Kind of, I don't know exactly how to describe that feeling, but like it has more contact, at least that's why I interpret or I learned. <clears throat> so let's see. You can see, yes. Yeah. I'm taking away that specific point there. See, I haven't relieved it enough, so I have to relieve it more here and uh, here, and then just work on the rest. So, yeah, you can feel it sits better now. A little bit more coverage. So, um, oops. See. That's pretty good. I think I can, at this stage, just measure here whether this is very low. And uh, if not, then proceed to the, um, to the other side and then go back here with the, to get the, the points afterwards, so to speak. So I think at least this sits flat for the purpose of testing the other side. So I think I'll leave it there today it's been another three hours i guess so two or three hours but this is more fun i think really? and to prove that this side was concave with the bluing we can just have a go at that too so just a quick check see how it is before scraping Oops. can see, as I said, touching only on the, the extremes and uh, knowing that this is like uh, it was 600 higher than here and about the same here in the 5 or 6 and you know when you run the table on top of that it's 
not at least uh, the best it can be.